this was probably the only decent one. All my other faces were kind of mouth open, gaping and looking elsewhere. Um, so I was happy that the photographer kind of got a decent one that I could post on Instagram. Hey guys, uh, I'm Riley McGree from Adelaide United and uh, apparently I've got some explaining to do about some Instagram photos. Okay, so this one, this was taken a few years ago. It's my childhood cat pet. Um, we were chilling on the couch together and he decided to kind of have a bit of a photo bomb. I'm not actually a, a cat person, I'm more of a dog person, but um, we've had him for a while. Um, we got him, he was stray, so I've kind of got a bit of love for him anyway. All right, this one, um, this was set up. I didn't pose like this. I, I was told to pose like this. This was at, um, when I was at Club Bruges. Good memories and it was a great learning curve for me to kind of see where I was at and um, what I needed to do to, to make the, the step back over to Europe, hopefully one day. They kind of, they told me to be one with the ball and show a bit of love to the ball, so that was my attempt at doing so. <laughs> I'm a little bit sick of this one. asked about it a lot to this day but um, it's obviously a good and proud moment for me but um, I do get asked a lot about it and I kind of just try and play it off and start talking about something else. I guess it's got to comes with the job kind of thing. This was taken just as I signed for Melbourne City. I got a few comments on my photo with the snake emojis and all that but it's all part of the game and I embraced it and pushes me to be better and do better things. This is a great great memory and a great moment for me you know I got to meet Pep Guardiola and um, we chatted about football, um, but he tried to not to talk too much about football, just how we are, how we enjoy Melbourne and, and how the club is. And, and I'm just glad a photographer's there to capture it because maybe no one would have believed me if, if I told him so.